Okay, you guys, today we are looking at a Synology DVA3219. This is their deep learning uh, surveillance station NAS. Usually it's meant for that. It does come with a GPU card inside, which I believe is a uh, NVIDIA uh, 1050 Ti. Um, unfortunately, it can't be used for Plex or anything like that for rendering the video streaming, but it's performance based for the surveillance station to do um, intelli intelligent learning. Um, so we're going to go ahead and open this up so you can see what the video card looks like inside. And we're also going to take the 4 gig uh, that it comes with and we're going to upgrade it with this 32 gig kit also to give it some more memory so it can perform a little bit better. So let's go ahead and dive into that. Alright, we went ahead and removed the top cover. And you can see on the back here before we get into the video card, we have two eSATA ports. We have the two USB 3.0s. And then we have four one gigabit NICs, which is usually standard in the better NASAs, a serial port, and then our power cord, of course. So once you take it apart, you can see the reason why they have this uh, so much wider is because now you got a GPU that's doing a lot of the uh, NVR learning processing using a GPU card now. And you can see there's video outputs here, but they're not utilizing that in the back. So it's probably uh, disabled, but it would have been nice if they would have open up one of these slots so you could plug in an HDMI so then you could stream your cameras to the TV or something so you don't need another device to do that with but um, you know it is what it is so now let's go ahead and do our memory upgrade definitely a big fan of the new NASAs for sure because they have the memory upgrades on the bottom now just like the DS1819 plus that I did in another video so we just undo those two screws take the panel off we're taking our 4 gig um, dim out of here take that 4 gig out we have the, uh, I'm a big fan of the Crucial uh, kits. This is a th Crucial 32 gig DDR4. So I'm gonna take them out and you just slide it in there, just like so. So we've just taken our four gig memory and upgraded it to 32 gigs now. So now let's go ahead and power this up. And when you do these memory upgrades, you have to give it at least 10 minutes or more. I um, mean, I think it even tells you on the back panel, yeah, it does. Um, so you just got to be patient uh, when, when you do any kind of memory adjustments because it just has to do a memory test and uh, calculate the new memory. So just give it some time um, when you power it up. All right, you guys, that's it. So the, like I said, this is, again, this is a DVA3219. Comes stock with 4 gigs of memory, uh, a 1050 Ti GPU, and I believe it's 4 cores. And you can easily upgrade your memory to 32 gigs to get better performance out of it, especially if you do a lot of the uh, deep learning uh, rules for the video cameras.